Hello everyone, how are you doing? Oh my. So, if I plan this out correctly, this video right here should be coming up on 1010. October 10th, 2002, this is the 1010 portal. I am doing a live tonight on the Bright platform. There are details to get tickets in the description box. Please don't miss this one. Very important so that you can have a clean ending, yes, and have your own new beginning. And if we're in a group, right, that will intensify the intention, the energy, um, opening this portal and bringing that beautiful miracle blessing energy to us. But you're also putting that energy out into the collective. Okay, and it's so important right now. So if you can do it, there are replays available on the, the live. So if you can't exactly make the live, you can see it later on. They're really great. I think they typically get the, um, the watch link up like 24 hours later or something like that. Great team. Guys, I know some of you were a little like, I don't know about this platform. Let me just tell you, they've been nothing but kind, supportive, they have made my life so easy when it comes to lives <laughs> so, and being able to connect with all of you. And they have a lot of other great uh, creators on there who are doing really impressive stuff. So just, you know, if you get a chance, if you don't check out one of my lives, get on over there and see what is there. If you choose not to do any of that, make sure you're still taking advantage of today's energy. So we have Oceana, take action. You're in touch with your truth in this situation and you need to trust your gut and lovingly assert yourself. Here is your chance to re-script your reality. So we're going to be talking about all that tonight. And the ocean here, can you see she's diving deep into the ocean? That represents emotions. So the deeper we go, interestingly enough, the calmer the water. When you're on the surface, right, when we're in our 3D reality, waves are crashing, there's a big storm ahead or, or above us, and, you know, we don't know if that ocean is going to take us, right? But when you're going into the depths, when you're going into your soul self, your soul can breathe wherever it is. Your soul can still communicate to you if you're listening. You can tap into your emotions and get some feedback through those emotions, okay? So especially if you're having weird dreams around this time, again, we can talk about all of that tonight, but um, if you're having weird dreams, there's probably a lot of emotions that are trying to come up to the surface. I, just to give you an example, I've been having so many weird dreams that I work at one of my old jobs. I know. And I get into the elevator and the buttons are not numbered and I don't know what floor I'm supposed to go to. And then in another dream, one of my old bosses popped up and was like, I showed HR your, your resume and they said it was bad. And in the, <laughs> it wasn't well written. And in the dream, I started going off on him and going, what the heck does HR know about good writing? You know, and don't you say that to me and so on and so forth. And there were people in that company who did not want me coming back and said she was nothing but a troublemaker. I've never been a troublemaker in any job I've ever been in. I can't help what people do. People are nuts, okay, and they just be nuts, okay? But yeah, like I've been having all of those dreams and for me personally, I'm still sitting with the feeling of it, not trying to over-intellectualize it and make it make sense because that's not gonna work. <laughs> that's not how dreams work. But really tapping into what does this make me feel? Do I have a fear of being a leader? Do I feel like I have to get permission still to be a leader? Have I been sort of trained and conditioned to think that I can't make it on my own? That I need other people, right? And I can still sit with that and probably come up with a million other things. But if you are having those kinds of dreams, sit with them, sit in your feelings, see what comes up for you. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.